Dr. Strange. Your work saved the lives of thousands. What if I told you that reality is one of many? Strange is incredibly arrogant, brilliant, sort of extraordinary, and his need to control fate, to control destiny, and in particular death, has brought him to the height of his profession as a neurosurgeon. He has a car crash and he loses the use of his hands and he spends all his money having operations to have his hands put back together and they don't work. He has quite a journey as his life starts to fall apart. He spends his last pennies on a ticket and goes to Nepal. He's searching for a cure for his hands and the issues that he's having. My character introduces him to this different, very mystical world. He finds the Ancient One who is the Sorcerer Supreme. You wonder what I see in your future? Possibility. Brings out this spiritual dimension which he never knew was possible. And he soon realizes the potential of someone who could help on a grander scale than he'd ever imagined actually existed. We're excited about the villains in this film. These are people who become seduced by what they find on the other side. You'll die protecting this world. They are interested in spilling the barriers between these dimensions, which would annihilate our entire universe. I can't do this. There is no other way. There's a lot of real world live action in this film. There's a lot of drama, a lot of comedy, but there's also the most extraordinary, fantastical adventure. I think it's gonna be a great cinematic ride. What if I told you the reality you know is one of many? This doesn't make any sense. Not everything does. Not everything has to. Through the mystic arts, we harness energy and shape reality. We travel great distances in an instant. How do I get from here to there? How did you become a doctor? Study and practice years of it. There's a strength to him. But is he ready? Careful which path you travel down, Strange. Stronger men than you have lost their way. I am death. In pain. You'll die protecting this world. I can't do this. There is no other way. I've spent so many years hearing through time. Looking for you. Now what's this, my mantra? It's the Wi-Fi password. We're not savages. Okay, so what did you think of that video? Now I've got some more on Doctor Strange for you. Did you know that many people have been trying to make a Doctor Strange movie since the mid 80s? Mm -hmm. From 1986 to 2005, people within Hollywood, such as Bob Gale, Wes Craven, David S. Goya, and even Stanley himself with co-writer Alex Cox, have all tried to make a film adaptation of Doctor Strange, but failed. No Doctor Strange movie has ever made it past the pre-production phase until November 2015, the date when the new Doctor Strange movie started filming. Now, did you also know that Benedict Cumberbatch originally turned down the role of Doctor Strange? Mm -hmm. 
When Cumberbatch was first approached for the film, he originally turned it down due to scheduling complications. However, when the release date for the film was pushed back from July 2016 to November 2016, Cumberbatch was able to sign on to the project. Now, to do some prep work for the role, Cumberbatch taught English at a Buddhist monastery in India. In the comics, Doctor Strange was trained at an Eastern monastery. So to prepare for the role, Cumberbatch volunteered to teach English at a Buddhist monastery in Jajiling, India for a year. So, do you think Doctor Strange will be a success for Marvel? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. I'm Lisa, and thanks for watching.